everyone and welcome back it's your girl marquita with marquita lv luxury as you guys can see i am just super super excited like i cannot wait to talk about the lv spring summer 2023 collection that has been just going crazy on instagram but before we get started make sure you view my past videos like share and subscribe tell a friend how much fun we have over here don't forget to visit your girl on Instagram at Marquita LV Luxury. Now that we have that out the way, you guys know exactly what to do. Go grab some wine or some tea and a light snack. Hurry back so we can get started. Your girl got the tea, so now let's talk LV. Oh, okay, guys. So, yes, I'm excited. Um, I just told myself discipline, discipline, and here LV goes with this runway, and we see all of these creative handbags. I mean, creative handbags that they are releasing next year so we are going to get straight into it guys i have my phone my iphone 14 came in and my iphone 14 pro so i have both of them so i hope the screen is clear so guys let's get straight into it the first thing that i want to speak on of course of course is the key pouch the reverse monogram key pouch that's coming out i have it pictured here all of us should have at least one key pouch in our collection but guys this here is on another level so basically they just enlarged very very big enlarged the key pouch and turned it into a large giant clutch basically this part here the d-ring here is where she is placing her hand and look at me trying to do it with this and turns it into a clutch well guys what made them use the reverse monogram print i know they were thinking of me i i i know they were they have been thinking about me lately and so lv hey look i love you guys thank you you got me back i'm back with you guys okay <laughs> so guys this is so creative um very large i mean it's bigger than the key falls that we have, our duffel bag. So where are we going to go? That's the question. Are we purchasing to say that we have it? Are we purchasing to use it as what, a display? I mean, what are we purchasing this for? Where are we going to go? So I'm very, very curious to see how we are going to purchase and, act, and actually use this item. <laughs> because... I'm interested. I just don't know if this is going to be a real thing or if it's, you know, to catch our attention, which it did because it's everywhere on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. So this right here, I absolutely love. You guys know how I feel about reverse monogram. I feel it's very creative. I can see what they were trying to do, but LV, how are we honestly going to use this key pouch? Since it doesn't come with a strap, are we just going to have to carry it around as a large clutch whenever we go out? I mean, I don't know. Is it going to have an inside pocket? I can't wait. I have so many questions, guys. <laughs> okay, so next, I thought was very, very beautiful. The black coosin, guys. I had one coosin in my um in my collection. It was the Rose Ballerine Pink. I sold it last month. But I love this black color. You guys know... Look here, black gold hardware is one of my favorite color combos. This is very, very unique. I want to know, will the strap, the gold hardware strap, is it detachable? Is it heavy? <laughs> I have so many questions because the Coulson uh, gold chain strap, toe strap is very heavy. So this is like 10 times larger so is it heavier? Can Is it detachable? And also, guys, I have to ask this question. Does it come with a strap, a longer strap? 
where are we going to go? As you guys can see, she is toting it as a clutch. This is my largest handbag in my collection, the I Care Maxi from YSL, and it is large. These handbags are larger, but I'm so invested. <laughs> I am so invested. Um, to me, the cushion, the material was never just, I need some carefree bags. I can't babysit. Um, but with this being the color black, I'm wondering, I don't know. And guys, just looking closer, I do see where it does detach. Do you guys see? Let me let me move it in some. So it is it's going to be detachable. This is going to be a heavy, heavy chain tote strap. I don't even know what other handbags we can use it on. But again, I am invested. Very, very invested and very curious. I want to see how large the zipper is. I just, LV, I'm excited. I, I have to keep, I have to keep moving. I'm excited. Okay, so now moving forward. Okay, so the bag tags. I have one here just for reference. I took this off of, was it? Yeah, my Ammo BB. I took this off my Ammo BB. I think this is so cute. I love how they actually took the key and put it on the side as extra decor. You guys see, I have it hot stamped. I am absolutely ready. And I love how they basically turned it into a tote. So I'm guessing I see a zipper on the side. It's a red, black, a beautiful turquoise, and also a vachetta. So I see it better on this one, on the vachetta. I see it has a zipper opening. It goes all the way around. So on the side and under and on the opposite side, that's where the zipper is. And I think the key is actually part of the zipper. I thought that was just there for decor. So I think that is actually the zipper handle. Okay. The key, it looks like it's the zipper handle. Okay. So basically you are going to have to unzip and turn it over and then open it. Hopefully it's wide enough since it, is, it goes from one end to the next. So I'm pretty sure it's going to open a bit wide, just like the ammo BB. So this is the bag tag from the ammo. So I'm just hoping it opens wide just like that. But yeah, I really, I think the key is a part of the zipper. So guys, this is going to be so amazing. Oh my God, I'm so excited. And I see the black and red. It shows the back. I'm wondering, will it have the gold hardware like this? Guys, I have all my props, okay? So do you see how it has the gold hardware on the Vachetta piece, okay? I am wondering, will all of the bag tags have this on the front? When I say I'm invested, I'm invested. So guys, which color are you interested in? So if we do, that Vachetta is, is beautiful, but that... <laughs> You're going to have to have like four cans of Apple Guard to protect this. If it's full Vachetta, the toad handle, everything. So I am going to stay away from that, okay? The turquoise is very pretty. I love it. Stand out, very bold, but I need everyday wear, okay? I need to, I need to be able to pick this up and go when I please, unless I'm purchasing just as a statement piece. Okay, so I don't even think this is this is not an everyday bag. These are basically statement pieces, bold statement pieces. Basically, hey, I got it. I was able to purchase. It's in my collection. Now what? That's what these pieces are. Okay, so we have the red, we have the black, we have the turquoise, and we also have the vachetta. I only took screenshots of the items that actually caught my eye. So many items we saw on the runway, but I'm only speaking on items that I am interested in, okay? And this is the back. So yes, guys, I had to look through the pictures. So that is going to be on the front because this is the back of the Vachetta piece. So that was the front. 
And then this is the bag. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so next we have the LV Twist. These handbags are out, okay? I've never just really been interested. I've You guys ask me a lot, hey, do I have any handbags from the LV Twist collection? And no, I don't, but these are very cute. I love the mini size, and I honestly think the gold chain, I can see the gold tote chain strap is not detachable. So it's basically going to hang, just like all of the, our other bags, just like the Loop Gym. I had it with me. Okay, just like how the Loop Gym has the gold chain um, tote strap, I think this is going to be the same. So it's basically going to hang, and then they have an additional longer strap to where we can wear as a shoulder bag or a cross body, but it's very elegant. This is classy and it also speaks boss, guys. I love how that LV is very, very large. And then you twist the L and it, you know, it just aligns with the V and you're able to open. So the twist handbag is a very classy, very elegant handbag, but this mini size takes it to another level for me. I love it. I love this cream color. I love the gold hardware, but this color here, LV, you're bringing it to the spring and summer collection. So that means, guys, I'm hoping that we get more handbags. We have the uh, the go on the go tote in the GM size. We have the beautiful Speedy. So I'm not sure if this is the cognac color or a more of a caramel, but I love the color, period. You guys know um, this is going to be their very big color for this fall season, but they are bringing it over to the spring and summer collection. So I love the gold hardware with this color. So I don't know if it's caramel. I don't know if it's the cognac, but I want it. Never been interested in the twist handbags until now. And it also comes in this beautiful, oh my God, this epi leather, guys. And I believe all of them are epi leather. Yes. All of them are epi leather. And I think the twist handbags are epi leather. I really don't just pay attention to them like that. But just looking on this black, it, it just brought, you know, just brought it out to my eye that is epi leather, but it has silver hardware. I'm wondering, do they have one with gold hardware or it's going to be just silver, but the silver stands out and I love it. Absolutely love it. And I'm looking around my collection. I don't have a black and silver hardware handbag in my collection. Hmm. I don't know. I'm thinking about it, guys. I'm thinking about it, but I am just so excited. Now, I can honestly say I am I am Team LV. I'm back. I'm back. I love creativity. Okay, so the next that I want to talk about are the beautiful S-Lock handbags. Whoa. When I say creative, I mean creative. So, basically, this is what they call an S-Lock, guys. And I just grabbed the first item that had an S lock. So basically, you just push it together and then it opens. Okay, let me, I can't do it with one hand. But you push it together and it opens. And I just keep some of my, <laughs> because they fall out the bag. These are the labels with the product code numbers. I just put them in here and I just put them up later. But now this is the Scott box, if you guys ask. This is a real item. I'm not sure if it's still on the website, but I basically purchased to have as a small tote and for decor here in my closet. So back to what we we're talking about. So this is an S lock here. The push closure, they basically turned it into a handbag. And I will say this is the most creative thing I've seen on the runway. They created it and made it a tote bag. I'm not sure if it's going to come with a longer strap to where you can convert to a crossbody or a shoulder bag, but this beautiful red, amazing. You guys know that's what I've been looking for, a red tote handbag. That's why I went with the bucket handbag from Marc Jacobs, but this right here screams, oh my God, I love it. The red and gold combo, amazing. And I love the circle LV that's at the top. 
So let me put this down and let's go into some details, guys. Like I am just so happy with all the gold hardware on that handbag. And so we have the beautiful red. Of course, they are not staying away from Vachetta at all. <laughs> so we have the Vachetta and we have the gold. This is beautiful. I want this. It holds the phone. It like it can hold a phone. And I'm pretty sure this is a mini size. It looks like it, it will be able to hold a phone. Um, I'm just wondering. I don't know. And guys, I do see that the toe strap on this Vachetta. And I'm just talking to myself. So I'm, I'm talking out loud. So I see that the tote handle. Because I see the D-ring on the side on this Vachetta piece. That is going to be detachable. So when the tote handle based on all LV bags, if the tote handle is detachable, it has another long strap that's included. So we are going to get a longer strap with this handbag and we are going to be able to convert it into a shoulder bag and a cross body. I am manifesting all of this, guys. I don't even know if I'm right. I'm just speaking on just my experience with LV and um, their detachable tote handles, okay? This black... On the black, they dropped the ball. I think they should have just went all gold in the front like they went, like they did with the Vachetta. We need that gold, LV. Quit holding back. We need the gold. Um, I have enough black and gold handbags in my collection, so I will pass on the black. But I love how the LV circle stands out at the top. But again... They should have kept it all gold like they did with the Vachetta. So, the beautiful black. Okay. So, next, guys. I want this. I want this. I'm not really big on, on Louis Vuitton vintage pieces. But, of course, uh, when my husband saw this and I showed him, he was like, wow. He said, they like something Princess Diana would carry <laughs> But I just think it's so beautiful. I'm pretty sure LV has a vintage handbag that is similar to this. But I want this. Everything about this handbag, I love. I love the small monogram details on this handbag, okay? I love it. The Vachetta, I'm so glad they kept it. The Vachetta, I love this. The Vachetta goes perfect with this. The only thing, the one handle, the one tote handle, I'm okay. I'm okay with it. The bag tag, I don't know why that was added, but I am going to add my, my initials in hot stamp here. But I wouldn't have that bag tag on there. To me, it takes away from the classy look, adding that bag tag. But I would just take a bag tag and add it to another handbag. But the bag tag would come off. I love how it has the S lock open and close closure. I want this. I want this. And it also puts me in the mind of the new favorite handbag that, um, that was released. The new favorite that was released. But I'm pretty sure there is a vintage handbag from LV that you guys know about. Or you probably have in your collection that this honestly is similar to. I can't speak on it because I'm, I don't collect LV vintage handbags. But this is on my list. I want it. It also comes in this beautiful turquoise color. A lot of you guys are fans of the turquoise from LV. So here it goes here. Um, to me, it's beautiful. I love the color. But then again, I want something that I can honestly use. This is another statement piece. And I did tell myself for the new year, I will start adding more color to my collection. And so I wouldn't just say I wouldn't purchase, but it's just not a favorite color of mine. Okay. And then they have, um, then they have another one that has the black leather and I believe it's the Python material. I'm not real big on handbags like this, but just if you guys are interested, it is coming out. You want a carefree tote. This is it. One handle, black leather. There you go. 
And also, guys, we have to speak on the large bag tags. Guys, these bag tags come off of our key balls. I have it right here. <laughs> Already hot stamped. This came off my key ball 45. I love traveling with my money ground key ball. But as you guys can see, I already have it hot stamped, M-N-G. And I can't wait. I cannot wait. This is so creative. And I love how they turn the strap, guys, into a little tote handle, LV. I just, I'm, I commend you. You did it. So I am going to walk around and hold this and just hope and pray I end up with one. Okay, <laughs> it's not the same size, but I am just going to manifest and pretend I am holding one. So here it is. The, it's, the closure is going to be right here. As you guys can see, that's where the zipper is going to be. And then we're going to have the option to unbuckle. So we're going to have to unbuckle and then probably unzip unless it is open at the top. I don't know, I really can't see that well. Even on the black, I really can't see. I just see that we have the buckle. And here at the top. On the side, it doesn't show any sign of a zipper. So maybe at the top, maybe it's open, just like a never full, like an on-the-go tote. I'm not sure, but I'm hoping that they do have some type of zipper to where we can close it. Okay, and as you guys can see, I already hot stamped mine. I already told you guys I'm manifesting this thing. It's going to come. I am going to receive something from this runway collection, okay? I am going to receive something from this collection. So, let's see what else I want to talk about. Okay, so guys, I did see this. Someone sent this to me via Instagram. I'm not a fan of it it's just basically like a threaded knit duffel bag i just feel like this is going to i don't think it's going to go well <laughs> i it's not a carefree um keep all i basically wouldn't travel with this it would be a showpiece in my collection <sighs> of course guys it's a carry-on it's not a check-in handbag Unless you just want to go through the airport, stunt, have your swag together. I totally understand because I love, I love swagging out. And when I say swag, I love being creative and I love being like, oh my God, who is she? Or, oh my God, where did she get that? So yes, this keep all is a statement piece. It does scream, even with all the colors, it does scream luxury and she paid a ton for that. So not my cup of tea. Because I don't just, I don't know. It's just too much for me. It's just too much going on. And I don't want to have to worry about anyone wondering what's in my duffel bag and my keep all. Because I already had one of my luggage, you know, stolen from United. But again, it's an option. I just wanted to bring it to light. Someone sent it to me. I think it's very unique. It's very different. I am team different. I am team unique. I am team creative. But... This isn't something that I will actually purchase. I would rather have a handbag than this keep all. But again, very unique, just not my style. Okay, so guys, I went over the items that honestly, like, caught my eye. Caught my eye that I'm actually looking into purchasing let me know how you guys feel. Some of you guys were like, oh my God, you were super excited. Yes, this is different. And then some of you were like, oh my God, this is just a waste. Which some of you guys will feel like that because there are so many bags that we want and they're discontinuing. It's so many bags that we are waiting for that they just won't create. Like the Palm Springs Mini Unprunt Leather in Black. I want that. But again, um, guys, I'm super excited. Like, I really am. Um, I just can't believe it. Like, this is totally different. This this honestly shocked, I think, the whole LV community. I am just so happy to be a part of it. So, guys, let's chit-chat in the comments. You, you know I was going to talk about this, okay? You know. So, do I need to go ahead and manifest and put Marquita 
like I did the Marquita Reverse Monogram Loop Gym. Do I need to just manifest and attach my name to one of these, these bag tags? Should I? I don't know. <laughs> but guys, as always, I'm like just too happy. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Until next time. And also, I am going live again tomorrow. So we can talk about this together. Because I'm not over it. It don't just stop here. So guys, make sure you tune in tomorrow. Live stream is going to be between 6 o'clock, 6.30 Central Standard Time. Tune in because we need to chit chat. I need to know. I need to talk to you guys. So thank you guys again. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Until next time. I love you so much. Bye-bye.